Welcome to Road to Untradables, my long-running spawn picker series in which I try to unlock every single untradable item within the game. Welcome to RTU. Also a little secret, I have a little special video planned for next, uh, for next video where we do something a bit more unusual having to do with this gear setup. <laughs> What's up everyone, Matt Raymond here and welcome back to episode 54 of RTU already, damn. Hope you guys enjoyed that little intro, as promised last time I'm going to do a little, uh, uh, something a little different than what I would usually do. Today we're gonna be PKing with a setup I've never used before and I wanted to use this, this is the Taze at Harketom Ore as well as the Berserker Necklace Ore which were added a few months back to the Bounty Hunter shop. Um, been wanting to use them ever since, however, it wasn't until very recently that we unlocked the Obsidian Helmet, the Cursed Obsidian Helm. So now we have the full set and we can get most of the benefit out of these uh, items when PK. So that's why I decided to finally deliver on what I've been wanting to do for so long and do a PK video with that setup. I'm very curious to see how high we can hit, how accurate it is. I'm gonna be risking a lot. We're gonna start off with some non skull PKing with the Holy Berserker Pet because the Cursed Set also gives quite a little smitey boost. However, if that doesn't go fast enough, I will get a Death Pet out and unskull so I can protect both the Necklace as well as the Mole. Otherwise, there's no uh, good idea for me to skull, you know? We are risking a decent amount, I got some 50 blood money that we are risking. We keep most of the items obviously, but we are risking the life gloves, 50 blood money as well as a 5 build orb. Should be plenty of risk for most of the PKs at least. I mean even if you're risking like fast I'm still risking more. Anyway, let's get into the giveaway before we get into the video. Episode 54, I don't have the bonds on me, but we are of course doing another $25 and all you need to do is subscribe to the channel, like this video, comment your in-game name down below and turn on the post notifications so you can stay up to date with new video uploads. Whew, mouthful as always, hope you guys enjoy, let's get right into the video. We currently have 91 tier 1s in our bank, so I figured it's a good time to start upgrading those sons of a bitches and uh, we're gonna start bringing them into the wilderness now that we have plenty of them. Um, the Blood Orb does give a chance to get two tiers in a one kill, so hopefully we can see a bunch of those and not die too often, because uh, I would rather make some money this video than lose another shitload of it, as I have been for the last few. <coughs> Alright then, here we go. I hope this set performs as good as I, uh, as I anticipate. Even better would be if it completely outdoes my predictions of how well it will work. Okay, here he goes. <laughs> Good luck to him, let's see what we can hit with an obsidian knife, I'm very curious to see. Because if this thing hits absolutely nothing, it might not like fully work with full obsidian. But we're gonna have to wait and see how this performs. Not getting the type of hits that you would think, oh yeah, that, that knife is working. <laughs> I am very unsure if it even gets triggered by, oh never mind, 54, what? Come on big spec. Damn, not big enough. 59. <laughs> I think I smited him as well. What did I tell you guys? Holy crap. What was that out of nowhere? That's 54 knife though. What? I am so pleasantly surprised right now. 61. Oh, there we go. A 60 plus at last. No, he's steady 40. Why you do that? No. That was pleasant though. That was a... Uh, I'm surprised by how well this thing was hitting. That's absolutely insane. Should we see what our max is or should we leave? Nah, fuck it, let's see. 76? <laughs> I swear to God, if I hit that in a fight, a 70 fucking 6. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. That's like a full AGS pack, nearly. Holy crap, that would be insane. 76, dude, what the fuck? Okay, let's try with uh, the knife as well. 55. Hmm. Wait, that's actually pretty good. That's higher than what a Blood Whip can hit. 
Alright, let's keep going like this. Alright, we have our next target. I hit you quit. Let's see how this goes. Oh my... I almost killed myself right there. Holy fuck. Okay, let's uh, pay a little bit more attention. Jesus Christ, this vengeance is... I am hitting so incredibly high with this little thing. Little knifey. 46 into the... Oh, zero. Shame. The 70. 65! Gmo? Finish? Oh my... Why didn't it... The spec didn't go off. Why? Hmm. Okay, okay. Happens, no problem. We'll get another chance. Wow, okay, and we still managed to get it. No problem. Okay, cool. I have no idea why Gmol is struggling so much after the Obby Mall. Never had that issue doing Elder Mall or anything, but... Hmm. Might have to switch into something else for the spec if it keeps going like this. But we got our first kill. Good fight. Right, let's continue. We haven't seen half of it yet. We have Dealer Don again. Dealer Dunny. Best of luck to him. See if we can smite him again. <laughs> that was fun. I wanna see some massive hits th this time around. Ooh, that's dangerous. Oh my god, and of course I hit a 50 on his vengeance. Holy shit, mate. Chill. Chill, chill, chill. Maybe we should go for the GMO before we go in for the... Um, okay, yeah, that's, this is not working out as well as I thought it would. I really uh, am tempted to switch out my spec weapon because the GMO... Hmm. Maybe it's because I'm switching the amulet, I'm not too sure, but... I never really had this issue before in the past, so I'm... It's kind of new to me, I'm not sure how to do it. <laughs> I would like... For it to be instant. Otherwise we might just have to switch spec weapons and use something different. No, we hit a zero. Ah, okay, we're out. Good fight. Because we're struggling so much with, like, hitting their fences up and stuff, I think I'll try out the Toxxil Aka. Aka? It has a bit more strength, but I know it's a little bit slower, but we're just gonna try it. Oh, the knife thing does have a higher slash bonus, not a stab, but this one does have a higher stab. Yeah, it does. Alright, so we're gonna try it with this. It only has this one for stab. Let's see if this can hit anything uh, impressive on those little noobs. Right, good luck to uh, Wesley Snipes. I've always wanted to fight this famous actor. Let's see how this goes. 47. Come on. 65 already. Jesus. He's getting all of it. Yeah, he better eat to 90. <laughs> oh, 47. S 65 again. Good fight. This is pure destruction right now. When they are in welfare, man, whew, no chance. See if he wants to fight. Oh no, we got a knife from the preset. Here we go, good luck to uh, CMB. 58 without a... What? <laughs> what? That's higher than what the hit predictor said. That's at 57, right? Holy crap, with the little knife thingy. Okay, now at least I know I have to keep it on... Uh... Oh shit, Karasi, nope. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Mm -mm. Nope. He finishes me. There. Oh, 73! What? What? Oh my god. I know I can hit it, but it, it happens so rarely. It's so shocking to see a hit like that. A 73. Holy fuck, man. This setup is great. I love this. So fucking much. Right, we have Wesley Snipes again. I'm still using the little slashy slash knife thingy. Because I'm stupid. I keep forgetting to switch. Also, I was already in the wildy and I got a target when I realized it. Oh my god, I can't see him. Definitely want to have sights on my big ass hits. You want to eat against this, dude? I'm gonna smack you for that 70 HP. He's gonna, he's gonna be so shook if he gets hit for a 70. 48 into the... We really need to hit that triple paint packer punches, you know? Just massive hits after one another, so we can really get a smite off. He's gonna cross me. Guess not. Yeah, good fight, dude. 64 for the finish. Beautiful. Five kill streak already, and a tier three again. Very nice. All right, this time I got the claws out. I'm not gonna do an amulet switch because I can't be honest. We're gonna see how it goes with this as a spec weapon. Hopefully, we can hit high enough to uh, really create some opportunities. Let's see how it goes with the uh, all little knife stabby thingy. It's not stabbing though, the animation doesn't really fit the stab option, but 
hopefully within the stats calculations it does work. The reason I decided to uh, take out Claws is because um, uh, they changed the way Smite works. So now there's a max to how much points you can smite in one hit, right? So there's a... Oh yeah, good fight by the way. Um, there's a maximum of 35 points within one tick. So even if you hit an 80 with a War Axe, you're still gonna smite 35 points. However, if you get a high claw spec, all of those individual hits, or at least uh, per two that are in one tick, should be able to smite Prayer quite efficiently. And then on top of that, if we hit high enough with the Taze at Harkadom afterwards, we can really see some smites, hopefully. Definitely gonna try my best to get one or two smites in this video. And hopefully more than just an HS. Good luck to Leslie, our next target. Should probably start bringing uh, my pet and doing my PK task in the meanwhile. We need to see the big boys, man. Come on. Show me the money. 43. Vengeance. Beautiful. But we still didn't smite him. <laughs> Unfortunately. Wish I had Claws Ore, though. That would have helped. Because this spec... Uh, right, we got a Dragon 2H as well as the Genie Pet for our actual tasks. Let's see, I don't think this dude's gonna fight me, he's gonna back me to Skull even though I don't want to. So, let's see if we can find someone else. Mr. Lynx21, good luck, yes, he he's already going. Wow, how enthusiastic. Best of luck to you, man. Let's hope you don't get destroyed too badly. We're going for a Claws. Big, oh, 73, perfect, come on. 64, but it still didn't smite him. He probably wasn't 64 HP. That's the biggest issue, if they don't eat fast enough, I can't actually realistically smite all the points off, you know? Ah, damn it. Good fight, though. Oh, we have someone else on us. Good luck to make me. Hmm. Let's see how this goes. Oh, he's using a bomb on That's terrifying. Yes, he hit me as well. Oh, good fight, dude. Beautiful. Oh, I, I dropped my uh, Dragon 2 Age instead of equip it. That's great. Ha, <laughs> hold shift for a little too long, I guess. Good fight nonetheless, and a pretty ju juicy loot as well. Got some uh, good stuff. Oh, he wants to fight. Well, I do have a loot on me, but uh, fuck it. We'll, we can do two and one. Shit, what up? Been a while since I've done that. 49, come on, big hit. 64, good fight. Ah, I was really hoping that smite did. <laughs> Damn it. We have Noi over here. Let's see if he wants to fight. Fought him a few times in the last video, I remember him. Oh, and we have a no-armor tournament starting soon. Really, really trying to get a smite off of someone. I don't even know if he has anything to smite. 43 into the 64, beautiful. Nope, he died to the claws. Good game anyway. Blood money. Well, we have 10 minutes left, so we can do a few more kills. We have our next target, Mr. Raimi194. Good luck to you, sir. You're gonna need it. We have a little spawnable snack over here. Don't hit too high. And a five. I think he might teleport right here. We have five minutes left for the tournament. Oh, he died. Good game. Got my items off in time. Very nice. I think uh, we're gonna get ready for the tournament and I'll see you guys in just a minute. Gonna rush through it, whether I win or not. So, yeah. All right, we have our first round against 7AZ. Best of luck to him. I'm gonna let him think I'm AFK until the last second. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, I hope he's AFK. We're gonna eat a food though. Because we're gonna need that. Of course he would. Ha, <laughs> he went for the GMO. Ha <laughs> ha! Amateur! Okay, cool. Got me down to tree food now. With the vengeance. I think he might be out. Of course he comes back with a huge ADS poke. What are the odds of that? Good fight, man. Apparently he uh, completely annihilated me. Good, good fight, lol. GG's. Hmm. Happens. I thought I was up quite a bit, man. Don't lie. Alright, now that the tournament is over, let's continue our PKing session and get some more kills and amazing hits. I want to see some 70s, though. 59? Oh no, I meant to teleport. No, I died! Oh my god, I wanted to teleport so bad. On... On the Avenge hit. Damn it. Dude, I was on such a kill streak. 
was going so well so far. Damn it, first half of the video. Seems like we have a little rematch. Alright, here we go. Rematch against Recover. Let's hopefully hit something this time around. Ooh, he's starting off with some... Some fucking destruction, Jesus Christ, dude. Chill! Yeah, I know it's broken, dude. Everything after his Ebo is broken. Perfect, come on. Big claws. Oh, he's risking it. Ah, oh, good fight. I didn't expect him to do that, not gonna lie. Really thought I would get a first hit up before he would try to kill me. Damn, GG. Second death. Alright, we have a new f new fight. Loot my loot. Good luck to him. On next target. Big mall though. Nope. <laughs> Nani. Nani desk. Yeah. Damn it. Ooh, 59. <laughs> Why did I say that? <laughs> Alright, here we go. <laughs> oh my god. Do any OGs who used to watch Filthy Frank watch this channel nowadays? Like, does anyone who watched my Fitch remember Filthy Frank? Curious to know. Oh, 76 with a normal hit, are you... Oh shit. I don't know if that counted, but good game, man. My oh my. But uh, yeah, that, that Weeaboo's video. If you've never seen that, fucking search for it. It's hilarious. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, we have a next one. Was just about to lie to my joint, but we have a fight to do. Good luck, good luck. I would love a Zebo smite, not gonna lie. <laughs> that would be a good smite. Does he risk his Dragon Warhammer or does he have a death pad? Oh, there we go, 64. Good fight, man. Yeah, he probably had a death pad, I didn't see. GG, nonetheless. Ah, I said it in game. Oh shit, here we go again against this dude. Oh, he destroyed me so hard last time. I didn't die, but I'm about to. Wow, as if, as if I'm gonna do anything against that. Fucking A. We have loot my loot number one again. Best of luck to him if he comes to me, come on. He's keeping his prayer up so nicely. And I still managed to KO him. Wow, that was absolute destruction. I don't know, some people are just too good to smite with a cap of 35 points each. You're not gonna smite someone like that uh, if they know how to properly use super restores or anything, so it's gonna be a tough one. Um, we have a free kill over here. Oh, it's probably not even mine. What a waste. As predicted. Ripperino the Tear Emblemino. Oh, here he comes. Our next target, Bloody PK. Good luck. Hey, hey. Yo, dude, give me some breathing room, man. You're all, all up in my shit, you know? I'm gonna have to claw you now. 33. Big one. 70. Holy shit, mate. That's a good fight. Wish I would get one of those uh, hotspot caskets. I'm not seeing those. I've never seen one since that update got introduced. Never. Why are they so rare? I don't think their rewards are that good in the first place. Hey, we have our next target. Someone in Aaron's robes. Wow, we're already off destroying him right off the bat with just our little... Uh, mace thingy, knife, stabby, reno thing. Gonna claw him out right now. 69, good game if you're not gonna eat, man. That's uh, a bit of an easy kill. Definitely out ate that. Alright, we're down quite a few tier 1s. We're already up to 6 tier 2s and 11 tier 3s. I'm gonna see if I can get a tier 10 for this video. And uh, if not, we're gonna end it there because I feel like this is already going to be a long video because I am rambling, rambling, rambling a lot. I know, but I thought it was fun commentary, so I'm keeping most of it in. By the way, in case you were wondering, like, why aren't you using Blood Slayer gloves and boots and ring things to boost your uh, amount of blood money you get? But the reason for that is because I kind of want to risk something against people since I'm unsculling. So I figured it's I'm better off using items that will you know, require a protection, because I keep so many items in the first place, that's a fifth, wow, 57 into the 65, good fight there matey, but uh, yeah, so that's kind of my reason, guardian boots, and I risk the Goliath gloves and the blood berserker ring, just as a little bit extra risk, since I have so little if I don't use those items, so now you know. Right, we have house arrest, our next target, good luck to him. We're starting off with some strong hits. 
We're going for the claws right off the bat. Big spec, 65 into the zero. Hmm. Yeah, okay. That's not gonna smite someone, damn it. Really hope uh, Ryan revises the prayer drawing soon. So I would love to be able to smite people a little bit easier, and that's a good game right there with the claws. I have gotten so many claws PKs this video, like so many kills with them. Which is a, a surprise for sure, because they are not fucking good. Can't believe it's working out so incredibly well. It's kind of a weapon I would normally use just to hit off their vengeance and, you know, be able to do something better than that. But I'm actually getting quite a few kills with it. You would almost think I have a Dragon of Great Scroll on my account, but I still need to unlock that. I know, doubling is really sad, but then again, claws aren't as much of a threat on this server. As you would see on many servers. Oof. <laughs> and he said it as I said it in real life. That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> nice one. Boom. As long as he doesn't spec me out with a new spec. I see those spec period uh, drops. Come on, man. Are you kidding me? Oh no, he got me. Fucking A, man. Why? Why do I take stupid risks like that, dude? I was on all bruise. I know he was about to spec. And I stayed. Stupid. Gotta wake up, man. Stupid, stupid mistake. That was my last Goliath Gloss as well, so I have to buy a new one real quick. We have our next target, Lufiticus. Best of luck to you, man. He's dropping the you'll win at the very start, even though he's an OP spawnable Torax. One of the best defense armors in the game. Uh, let's see how this goes. Setup like this is really meant for like Zergs and stuff. He has a fucking Dragon Hunter Lance and he says you'll win at the start. Okay. Go cool, cool. Give me that smite. Nah. Good fight nonetheless. Very nice that we got him right there. Shame we didn't smite anything. Right, well, we got our tier 5 out right now. And we have Demesius 8 again or something like that. Let's see how this goes. He has a death pet for sure. My big claws. Oh, he didn't hit anything on me though. Shame. Dude, that's all good. If you knew what I can hit, you would eat that all the time. Hard to hit on arrows, apparently. Struggling like a real motherfucker. Uh oh. He hit a 101. That's why you fucking hate range into melee. God fucking damn it, dude. Oh, it hurts so much. Alright, I bought myself a little Zebo. If you can't beat him, join him, right? I have no idea how good this would perform with, like, <laughs> melee setup completely. Not using any switches for it or anything except for the Anguish necklace in my inventory. But we're gonna do that next time. Now, I don't usually do this on my videos at all. I think this is the first time I'll ever say it. But if for once we can get 150 likes on this video, next one I'll make, I will go and... PK until I will get a smite. If we get a 150 likes before tomorrow, I will do that. I will just keep pumping it out until I see a smite of at least, let's say, a 6 glide. Like an elemental dagger or a karasi, which is like 24 bill nowadays, but something of that sort. So, if we get 150 likes, I will do my very best and keep grinding it out till I get a 6 smite. With a setup like this and with the Zebo, it might actually be possible due to the high amount of DPS you can actually do with the Holy Zerg pad. Anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. It's a pretty long video and had a lot of commentary and a lot of blah blah I needed to tell you guys. Because I find myself such an interesting person. Anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. We're gonna leave it off uh, for today here. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. Metal Raymond out.